Hi guys, today I have a quick haul for you. I was on Instagram last week and I came across this really beautiful picture of a hummingbird and I had to have that stamping plate. So I went on a mission and I figured out it was Bundle Monster and I went to their website. This was the first time I'd ever dealt with them. I have to say the fastest shipping ever. I ordered Friday afternoon sometime and it got here today and today's Monday. So I was shocked that it said it was being delivered today because I didn't think it would be here. So let's get into it. The stamping plate that inspired this purchase was, is this one and it is Bundle Monster S155 and the Instagram user had used this image of the hummingbird and I love hummingbirds. I actually have two that are tattooed on my foot and they had stamped this in black and then colored in all the flowers and the hummingbird. It was so pretty and they put it on a white background on a nail and I had to have the stamping plate. Like I could not let it go. So the other images on here, uh, I'll probably, I don't know, I might use them, but I'll definitely use the hummingbird. My school mascot is the Bluebirds. Um, so we, I think when school starts up again, that would be a fun um, image to stamp on my nail and color in blue. I'm not really sure about the other ones. I don't know, they're kind of cute, but I definitely got it for definitely the hummingbird and I probably will use that little bird as well. Uh, the next stamping plate I came across just perusing the website was this one. It was so cute. I had to have it. All these little desert creatures and the cactuses. Look at this little scorpion. He's so cute. All the cactus. I just thought they were so cute. The snake was actually the one that uh, solidified the deal. When I saw him, I just loved it. I think they're so cute. And the last plate, oh, sorry, that one was Bundle Monster S168. And the last plate I purchased was this one, and it's just a bunch of hearts, and I thought it would be perfect to stamp and then color in, uh, make decals out of this for Valentine's Day or any time. I think hearts are just sweet. Um, and this one is Bundle Monster S115. And it's just an all over design of hearts that I thought would be just perfect. So along with these plates, and these were really inexpensive. I can't remember how much they were, but I was pleasantly surprised um, that they weren't overly expensive. So to go along with these, I got some, just their black stamping polish. I've had Conad and I have, I think MDU is my other black one. Um, and at the MDU one I really love, but it's the teeny tiny bottle. So I thought, well, it's almost gone. I'll give Bundle Monster a try. Um, so we're gonna, I'm gonna do some swatches later with this. And this one is just called Straight Up Black. So I'm excited to give that a try. And then I had to get some stamping polishes because I couldn't leave there without some. And these are my first, these are my first polishes from Bundle Monster. And I have to say they came well well packaged. They are not going anywhere. I did not, I was worried about the polish in the mail, but after I got this box, I thought, well, there's nothing to be worried about. They're not going anywhere. I bought the Weekend Warriors collection and it came in this little box and then each polish is snug. I mean, it's not moving. They're not going anywhere. And each polish has its own little hole here. And I'm going to get them out and show you. Okay, so this is what it looks like. All of them have their own little home. I'm going to try to squeeze them out of here. So I'm going to get them out of their package and then I'll meet you right back. Okay, I have released them from their packaging and these are what I got. This was the Weekend Warriors collection, and they're all rain, you know, rainbow colors. This one is so pretty. It's like a coral. It's, it's looking more pink on camera, but it's more of a corally pinkish red. And this one's called Rose Garden. And these are my first Bundle Monster stamping polishes. Oh, man. Yeah, they look really opaque. 
I think that will work just fine. I have some pop sticks off to the side that I'm going to swatch for you in just a minute so we can try them over black and white. Here is an orange color, nice bright happy orange, and this one is teepee tipping. That's really pretty. Yellow, nice bright yellow, and this one is called go be you. That's cute. And this nice bright neon green, this one's called Empire Club. And blue, nice bright sky blue. This is called Astronomical. Really pretty color. And, oops, and last is this purple. It's darker on camera. It's kind of a muted but bright. I can't really explain that. This one is called El Dorado. Nice bright purple color. Really pretty. All right, so I'm gonna get into the stamping. I just have a bunch of pop sticks here colored black and white so that I can do one stamp and then we can see what it looks like on black and white. So let me get these plates unwrapped and I think, I think for today's purposes and swatching, I'm gonna try out this hearts plate. So I'll meet you right back. All right, and Bundle Monster, like most plates, come with a protective film. So I just peeled that back and we're gonna, well, it peels off very nicely. And I'm going to give it a quick wipe with some acetone. I like to do that even though I know it's new. I just like to make sure it's extra clean. And the stamper I'm going to use is this one from the Born Pretty store. It's just the clear one that you can see through. Um, I have a 10% off coupon code that I'll link down below as well as I'll have it on the screen for you. So if you'd like to check that out, there it is. All right, so let's just go in rainbow order. So here's that purple, or purple, huh? Here's that uh, corally red color. Ooh, that picks up really nicely, holy moly. Okay. Ooh, look at that. That picked up really nicely. Oh, excuse the dryness, that's acetone. That looks really good. You can see it over the black and obviously over the white. Oh, I'm very impressed with this. This is really exciting. Alrighty. All right, I'm gonna try that orange next. Ooh, picks up really well. Look at that. Gosh, that is so impressive. Oh, there we go. There's the orange. It's nice bright orange over the white and over the black. You can definitely see it. It's more of a maybe goldish color. Oh, so much fun. Okay, now for yellow. Ooh, that picked up really well too. Oh my gosh, look how beautiful it is. Okay, look at that, over that black, holy cow, that is beautiful. A little hard to see over the white, I mean, you can definitely see it, but um, not as well, but over that black, oh my gosh, look at that. It totally makes a difference with good stamping polish. I am in love. All right, three more. Here's green. Oh yeah, 
That picked up really nicely as well. Oh, that was my terrible stamping job, but you can see that it stamps over the black. You can see it over the white. It's a little bit hard to see. In person, you can see it a little bit better. But look at that green pop over that black. Oh my gosh, so pretty. And now blue. Ooh, look at that, that is pretty as well. Ooh, look at that. Ugh, obviously I didn't get all the yellow off. Or the green, sorry. Oh my gosh, it stamps so well over that black. I am really impressed with this. Ooh, look at that. Wow, I'm very impressed. Oh my gosh, look at that. You can definitely see it over the black and the white. Gosh, that is so pretty. Oh, these colors are gorgeous. All right, and I do have one more. I'm gonna swatch that black, but from what I can tell these other ones, I'm going to love the black one just as much. All right, so here's that black one. Okay. Pick it up. Oh my gosh, look at that. That turned out really well. Oh my gosh, I love this. And this one, obviously, I'm just doing over white. Oh my gosh. That is so pretty. Oh, I am in love. I feel like I need to go order some more right now. <laughs> so it stamped so cleanly. Picked up. Look, there. I mean, even on the stamper, you can see it. Oh, beautiful. All right. Well, I will definitely be doing a manicure with these in the near future and probably in just a few minutes because I have naked nails and perfect polishes. All right. Here are all of the swatches I did today. You can kind of see them all out. I am absolutely in love with these Bundle Monster polishes and I will definitely be going back for more. Um, they shipped quickly, were packaged nicely, and are very, very well done and well made for stamping. Um, so I will definitely be going back for more.